Hello internet, in this video I'll do an out-of-box review and then installation of these Last Fit LED headlight replacement bulbs. I'll be installing these in my 2017 Ford Escape. And then exactly one week after posting this video, I'm going to do my very first live stream on Scott's Garage. Now Last Fit has agreed to give a free set of these away uh, to somebody. There, there are three things to do to qualify for this giveaway. First of all, like the video. Secondly, if you're not subscribed to Scott's Garage, subscribe to Scott's Garage. And then thirdly, in the comments section, tell us what type of headlights you're using. OEM, what came with the vehicle, or replacement headlights. If so, what kind of replacement headlights? And then finally, how's that working for you? So keep watching. Welcome to Scott's Garage. Welcome literally to my garage. If you like some garage time in your off time, if you like do-it-yourself projects, if you like working on your own car, even a project car, if you like organizing your garage, then Scott's Garage is a place for you. All of my do-it-yourself projects begin here in my garage. Welcome to my channel. Now, before I unbox the headlights, I'd like to point out that Last Fit reached out to me as a YouTube creator with about 20,000 subscribers. I'm not getting paid by Last Fit. They did provide me those these headlights to review. I also have an Amazon affiliate link in the description below. So if, if you do like the headlights and you don't win the, the free giveaway, and if you click on my Amazon link, a small portion uh, will be given back to Scott's Garage. It doesn't cost you anything extra at all. That's simply how affiliate links work. All right, let's take them out of the box. Okay, it comes with a product manual, and I'll read through this here in a few minutes. Looks like it comes with uh, several stickers, different colors, white, black, and red. I have a perfect place for these. You'll see where, I, where, I'll, where I'll put the sticker at the end of the video. Okay, so these are LED replacements. You basically have three choices when it comes to headlight replacement. You can go OEM, which are usually halogen. I know that's what my Ford Escape has on it right now. Secondly, you can get high-intensity discharge lights, uh, HIDs, um, and thirdly, the LEDs. Now, of the three types, the halogen, the HID, and LED, the, the ones that have the, the fastest emerging technology are these LEDs. They've come a long way in just a, just a year's time. And, uh, you know, this, like, brand-new technology. This particular replacement bulb is Amazon's number one choice. It's a 2022 upgrade for headlight replacement. This happens to be 6,000 lumens, and it's a, a cool white color, and uh, simply um, plug and play. Now, compared to the other types of, of headlights, again, the halogen, HID, and LED, I've replaced a lot of halogens over the year, and I've, I've done three sets of the HIDs, and with those headlights, you have to be very careful, wear rubber gloves, there's the, the glass around the, the filament, and be really careful uh, to not leave any fingerprints on the glass part because it can overheat. And I don't see anything like that with the, uh, with the LEDs. Now, I'm not going to touch them, put my fingerprints on them, but uh, there's just less chance of that happening. It's pretty much open. Uh, you have the LEDs on, on each side. And I, I know it goes in this way that the LEDs shine on each side, and then I have a projector type of lens that projects the light forward. Also notice that uh, there is a fan here, kind of like you would see on a computer fan. So this is a heat sink made out of aluminum, I believe, or an aluminum alloy. And so this will, uh, will keep it cool. And it's simply plug and play. So let's see how easy these are to install. And more importantly, if it's an improvement to what I already have. Now, fortunately, headlights are really easy to replace on this 2017 Ford Escape. Now, the high beams are on the inside, the low beams are on the, on the outside. And uh, each of these have a little rubber boot. So the first thing to do, I'm only replacing, by the way, the, the, the low beams on this. So you just, you just pull the boot off, comes right off. Now, these halogen lights, uh, maybe we'll get a different camera angle, but they're just straight in there. And you just turn counterclockwise, and they come right up. Okay, so here's a close-up of the original halogen bulb, this is Sylvania. 
And just a really simple wire uh, clip right there. So I'll just simply pull this back with two hands and it'll come right out. And let's see if I can show you what it looks like on the inside there. So very standard looking. Um, again, this is a projection headlight. So the LED will fit right in there and I'll turn it and put it in place. Okay, I used a little bit of bulb grease. You can get this at O'Reilly's. And it's a, a type of, of grease that uh, electricity, it's safe on electrical components. And I just always take this extra step and just put it on the leads there. Again, I'm only gonna do one side for now. And there's only one way that uh, this can click in there. It's like so. Okay, now it's gonna go in like, like so, and then I turn a clock, like so, and then turn it clockwise so that it's, it's straight up and down. Okay, that should be it. So there's plenty of room for the, the cover. I wasn't worried about that, but no problem. Okay, it's back in place. Let's see what it looks like. Wow, the LEDs are substantially brighter. So again, LED on the, the driver's side, the standard uh, OEM on the right side. Even in the reflection, you can tell the difference. Now there's a color difference for sure, but uh, there's a there's definitely a brightness difference. Uh, you could even you can see it by just walking around here. Again, there's the OEM, and here are the new LEDs. I really am impressed by these. This is an honest review. Uh, substantial difference. Again, uh, there's really no comparison. So um, let's do the other side. I said before that fortunately Ford headlights were easy to change, <laughs> not this side. Passenger side is a big pain in the butt. You have to remove or move the coolant reservoir to really get in there. Okay, with the exception of being upset with Ford because of the coolant reservoir being in the way of getting to the, the bulb, I'm very pleased with these last fit LED bulbs. I highly recommend them. So you can see the affiliate link uh, below. If you got any value from this video, please give me a like. It costs you nothing, but it's a great value to me. And in seven days, we will do the live stream and give away the free set of these bulbs. Hope you win. And as usual, have a great day.